this chapter as in the foregoing and that which follows is explaining and proving it, but with several very useful expressions which is literally interrupted the thread of his discourse. He points out that there is a great difference between the righteousness of the law, which the unbelieving Jews was wedded to, and the righteousness of faith offered in the gospel. That there is no difference between Jews and Gentiles, but in, in point of justification and acceptance with God, the gospel set them both upon his same level. For in Jesus Christ there is neither Greek nor Jew, neither black nor white. But how necessary it was that the gospel should be preached to the Gentiles, this was that the Jews were so angry with Paul for that he was the apostle. It was to bring them within the reach of the formation promise, an interest in which they should not envy to any their fellow creatures, they cannot call on him in whom they have not believed. Except they believe that he is God, they will not call upon him but prayer. The grace of faith uh, is through prayer. And my brothers and my sisters, we also see that whosoever shall call on the Lord shall be saved. Yes. How shall they hear uh, without a preacher? Yes. How can he preach his death he be sent of God? Yes. In verse 17 we read, we are told how. So then faith comes by hearing yes. and hearing comes by the word of God. Yes. Notice my brothers and sisters that Paul said the word of God is the power. God says in John 1 and 14 that Jesus is the word made flesh. So when Paul speaks of the word he is speaking of Jesus. And Jesus the word is preached and you're hearing it that Jesus causes faith to come alive in you. It starts your heart to believe in it. Jesus is Lord. And your mouth to say in Jesus is Lord and your Savior. The Word of God preached. The Word of God studied. The Word of God believed. The Word of God spoken. Bring faith in your mouth and in your heart. And by seeing it, you make it the word of faith to you which you release to God. You operate in faith by believing. You operate in faith by speaking. 
can be your God. Did you not come to God? And have you 